So today's project is to remove this uh, tool changer casting. Um, I already uh, removed the four bolts and it wasn't coming off so uh, there had to be some locating pins which would make total sense. Uh, and these, I found these threads, um, open threads, they're 5 sixteenth fine threads and I, uh, I thought that you know you could uh, screw a bolt in there and would push the casting out of uh, its uh, locating pins. Uh, that was my initial thought, so um, since I couldn't find any 5 uh bolt with more than uh, an inch and a quarter of threads, um, I uh, had to make my own, so I bought some uh, uh, threaded rod, and here I am cutting, grinding, and assembling uh, these uh, bolts. I, I, you know, I pushed with these um, with these bolts, and nothing was moving, uh, and you know, it felt weird. So I took them out and looked at the threads, and they were damaged, uh, just at the end, like the last few five uh, threads or so. So um, I took a closer look at. Uh, 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 you know, at, at the holes, and it became apparent that um, actually uh, these were the actual locating pins. For some reason, there are threads inside of them, um, but these are the locating pins. So I had to regroup, and uh, I called my friend Jack, Small Jack. Uh, <laughs> Um, which, uh, yeah, so I, I decided to use a jack to um, sort of push uh, the, uh, the casting out. So here I'm using my eyes to very precisely measure how much uh, spacer I need uh, <laughs> on the back of the, the jack. Um, uh, also, uh, another method that works uh, real well to uh, measure stuff is uh, a tape. <laughs> so here I'm uh, taking some more measurement. Suppose. Oh my god, sometimes I look like such an idiot when I work. <laughs> it's embarrassing. Oh boy. So here I'm placing a jack uh, between to put some pressure between the tool changer casting and the main uh, column <coughs> casting. Um, but uh, <coughs> the the pressure from the the jack alone was not enough, so I uh, did a bit of a hammering, and this is what released the pressure. And there you go. So this is a uh, very encouraging. I'm putting some more pressure the the bottom uh, the, the bottom um, locating pin was uh, harder to uh, get off but uh, I just uh, I just managed to have them both uh, released so now I'm taking the jack off and uh, removing the four screws and with this little pry bar I uh, will finally manage to be free. Yay! Okay. The whole point of removing uh, the uh, tool changer casting 
uh, was to um, get access to uh, this uh, sheet metal which serves pretty much no purpose now it was uh, uh, there were some bolts attached to it to uh, hold some like um, junction bucks and stuff like that but uh, there's no more need for it uh, since I'll be locating the junction box somewhere else so um, I uh, I wanted to remove this uh, sheet metal so that I could do a good uh, paint job and you know clean it all well so quickly before I end this uh, video uh, I just wanted to show this observation um, just beside the locating pin there is a threaded hole and I'm thinking probably from the inside of the column uh, one could uh, thread one of these uh, a bolt and push the, 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 the casting uh, out so uh, this is something that could be tried so uh, this uh, here is where the locating pin uh, was so next uh, project we are taking apart the uh, z-axis uh, so uh, thank you very much for watching and uh, see you next video bye